we've had some good completed work. So we've actually finished our Riverwall 922 strengthening works, which is right down the other side of our site over here. We're now in the process of handing back to London Borough of Hammersmith and Fulham for them to complete the arena statement of that footpath and to give this back to the public. Further to that, we've done some more a river wall work which involved installing marine oak fenders for, for barge protection. These will be things that we left in place for the safety of the public when they're yachting or rowing along the River Thames themselves. We've had to install maybe nine or 10 pressure relief wells that we can go and pump, lower the water level down, which allows us to carry on shaft excavating without causing a safety issue. We've prepared this site, the TBM's arriving, now they've been reassembled and they're ready to go down the shaft behind me. We've put them on these movable units known as SPMTs and brought them from their location by the office into the shed behind me. The plan is to take her into the shed, do our test lift, get her all ready. We will lift the gantry up over the TBM, lower it back down, connect it up, test lift, skid it out into the shaft. Given that it's a thousand ton lift, it needs some heavy duty lifting equipment. The machine we're using is called a strand jack. And it's essentially clamped in four locations, so you've got that extra measure of security and safety. From there, over about eight hours or so, it's going to be lowered very, very slowly to the bottom of that 53 metre deep shaft and then jacked into position into the tunnel added. The Eagle has landed. We know that we're really getting serious now about the start of the tunnelling operations. There's almost 25 kilometres of tunnel to be built. Just to be here to see the start of that today is really exciting. Before we can start our main bulk excavation for our shafts, uh, we have a team of archaeologists on site excavating down the first six metres. We in 2015 already excavated some archaeological trenches and back then we found a series of river walls or revetments. Well these are three defines today from the 17th century docks. They've just come out. One's a William III penny, 17th century buckle and some kind of ring. done really well so far. If you don't get that thing down that shaft, it's not going to be able to do its job. It's really exciting. Was it easy? Ha. Uh, if it looked easy, then we've achieved our aim. <laughs>